Hello everyone, I'm Sharon Tay. We want to update you on the stories we're working on tonight. This is CBSLA.com's The Rundown. Oxnard police and SWAT surrounded an apartment complex this morning after reports of an active shooter. Neighbors reported gunshots around 9.30 at the Sunset Cove apartment complex. Responding officers also heard gunfire and then they took cover. People were told to stay inside. Police eventually arrested the gunman. Nobody got hurt. A decision could come down at any time from Sacramento on the future of horse racing here in California. Senate Bill 469 is working its way through the legislature. That bill would expand the authority of the California Horse Racing Board, and it would give it the power to shut down a race track with little notice. Delta Airlines is waiving rebooking fees for passengers affected by a technical outage on Wednesday. The undisclosed issue affected some customers' ability to book tickets and board flights. Travelers complained on social media about error messages and uh, apparently two-hour telephone hold times. The airline says no flights were canceled, but several were in fact delayed. All right, check out the newest addition to the L.A. Zoo. Today, the zoo introduced us to a newborn zebra. The foal is still unnamed, but we do know that he is a boy. He was born to five-year-old female and a seven-year-old male. They were part of a herd of zebras that came to the L.A. Zoo in 2016 through a species survival plan. How handsome is he? All right, here's Alex Piston with a check of your forecast. Yeah, Sharon, heading into tomorrow, we are going to feel cooler temperatures, especially for our inland communities. But uh, along the coast, we're talking a mixture of 60s and 70s as we head inland. Lower 80s for areas like Lancaster tomorrow. Upper 70s for Palmdale. Lower 70s out towards Glendale tomorrow. And the uh, Inland Empire talking temperatures in the lower 70s, Stephen upper 70s Rancho Mirage in the mid 90s heading into tomorrow. So uh, first day of summer, the summer solstice on Friday and we are tracking a little bit of wet weather. So the potential for some drizzle light showers as we head into Friday morning for our coastal communities as we head inland. We'll see a little bit more sunshine and then as we see some ridging heading into this weekend. Well, we could see some warmer temperatures starting Sunday heading into the start of next week. Back to you. All right, Alex. Thank you. Join us on CBS 2 News at 5, 6 and 11 for the latest on your weather forecast and all of our top stories. This has been CBSLA.com's The Rundown. And watch CBSN Los Angeles streaming 24-7 on CBSLA.com or on the free CBS News app. We're also on Xbox One, Roku, PlayStation, Amazon Fire, and Apple TV. For Alex Biston, I'm Sharon Tay. Have a great evening, everyone.